The 2018 Alabama legislative session begins tomorrow in Montgomery. CBS 42 News reporter James McConaughey joins us live in the studio with a preview of what to watch for in this session. James? Well, Sherry, last year we saw the legislature forced into redistricting by judicial order. We'll see what effect that has, if any, because this is an election year. Now, among items on the legislative agenda, we'll see a few issues reappear. State Representative Wandalyn Gavon has pre-filed two bills in opposition to the Memorials Preservation Act that was passed last year. Senator Gerald Allen has pre-filed a new gun bill after his legislation aimed at establishing permitless carry in Alabama died in the House. And of course, the state budgets. Now, I caught up with Representative Matt Friday today, who said there's obviously work to do, but he's optimistic. On the general fund side, we've really struggled, but a lot of the things, as painful as they were, that we've done over the last three years um, have really, I feel like, gotten the budget under control. Um, and we're really looking this year with, uh, with receipts coming in, with the economy really booming, things are going well in our budgets. Um, so I, I feel like we've turned a corner. A Representative Friday was appointed to the House Committee on Fiscal Responsibility. It was created last year to address persistent problems with the state budget. Now, general fund dollars have regularly fallen short of what agencies say they need for corrections, health care, and other government functions. Live in the studio, James McConaughey, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.